everyone, this is Energetic Ruth. Today, for the first time, I'm going to try Rec Room's new consumable, the boba tea. The boba tea came out just recently, about a week or so ago, but I have yet to actually try it out. And it actually took a while for me to even earn it because it can take several games to earn one of these, or you buy in a bundle, or you're one of those lucky people who just gets it randomly right away for playing Rec Room Originals. So how about we get right into it and try yourself a boba tea. Sounds just like the, uh, the latte one. Yeah, that, that sounds just like what you get from the latte. Oh, wait a minute, that's it already? Oh, wait a minute. After you drink it, it's gone. It's like all clean. See that? Like if you compare this with a full one, it actually looks empty. So if we drop it... Oh, nothing? Oh? It came apart just like, uh, just like the latte would. So let's try this one more time. Let's watch it go down. Oh, that's cool. It did go down. Like, if you look at the straws, these straws are huge. One sip of these straws takes a large majority out. So let's try. Two. Three. Three. It only takes three. All right, let's see what it looks like when we drop it. Okay, so when you drop it, it goes... Okay, the straw jumps right out. The lid pops out, and there's the cup. So let's have another cup. It's full. One. Two. Three. And it's empty. Just a little bit left at the end. Kind of normal because people rarely actually like finish the tiny bit at the end because usually there's some grains or whatever uh, you would find there. So let's drop it. There you go. All right, so now let's spawn in some latte and compare them. When we grab a latte, and let's grab a boba. Same sound, right? Okay. Whoa. Nothing. No sounds coming out. Nothing. Nothing's coming out at all. Now these are definitely bigger than the latte, but the difference is the latte has a lot of detail to it. Like if this were to be, let's say, Starbucks, that's what they're trying to do here. And they even have like caution, it's hot. You would usually see about like if it's decaf or anything like that. But instead, it reads Potion, Auto Sprint, Junior Account, Double Shot. So that's pretty cool that they have like Easter eggs and stuff like that. And it even says like, do not microwave. Does your day have anything at the bottom? Nope. But still like, very simple details like that. Very cool. But when you go to the boba tea, there's the Rec Room logo with like a leaf and circle like that to try to say like green, it's good for you type of thing. But that's really all there is to it. So if I were to pick on details, um, I would say that coffee one, oops, like even has like these, I don't remember what they're called, but they come right out. If you were to in real life, just like over here, pop it off and then you drink it. But instead you just grab it and it removes. Stuff like that. Like that's pretty cool. Kind of like a bubbly where it's the bottle and you drop it and then it separates or it just does something. For the boba tea, nothing like that. So if we were to give latte and the boba tea points, I would give latte a point for the spawning. Now for the details for the bottles or the containers themselves, I would give latte another point for the details on the bottle. Now for the drinking effect. I think I would actually give a boba tea a point there because it would come down part way and you can actually see it do it. Kind of like with the bubbly where you would drink it and watch it go down. Okay, so for the pouring, I would say like the latte, that's pretty cool. 
Uh, for the boba tea, like, it doesn't happen out of the straw. Like, you would expect it to come out of the straw, or I don't know, is this, like, really thick or something like that? I've never had a boba tea in real life or anything like that. But I think I would give latte a point there. Now for the dropping, let's go ahead and drop that. Oh, <laughs> there we go. That's kind of funny. Okay, so all of them drop- whoa, that just disappeared. So all of them dropped in three different pieces. So I would give both of them a point because it's kind of equal there. Now, when comparing the boba tea to the lattes, I would actually give it to the latte because the latte just has a little more details to it than the boba tea. I do still think that the boba tea is pretty cool. I'm glad that Rec Room added another consumable. The straws are just, <laughs> the straws are just huge. But there's still some great things about the boba tea, like the drinking effect and actually holding it empty. I think that's pretty cool. So let me know down in the comments, what do you think about the boba tea? Are you glad that Rec Room added it? What do you think is great about it? What do you think is bad about it? Uh, let me know in the comments if there's any details that you actually like to be added to the boba tea. If you enjoyed this video, then please leave a like and support me in Rec Room. You can do that by going to the play tab, then going to the code button and type in the word Ruth. So with that, I'll see you later.